Hey guys, welcome back to another review. So once again, thank you to Born Pretty for sending these products to me to review. Uh, if you've not seen my first um, review of the uh, of the other plates, then I'll leave links to that in the description box below. But this is the plate that I'm going to be reviewing today. So it is from Born Pretty, although it's not under the Born Pretty sort of section of their website. Um, but I absolutely love this plate. It's got so many really pretty images on them. So this polish I got on my recent holiday when I went to uh, Mallorca. So I wanted to see whether it would actually stamp. So it looked a lot better than I was expecting. I know it's not particularly bright, but these polishes do look quite sheer. So you can see here that it has stamped well, although it's like a bit more of a subtle stamping. I am actually quite impressed with how that's stamped. And this was the other polish that I got. It's a lovely two-tony pink purpley colour. So I tried to put it over um, like a neon pink and it has stamped but it was it was too sort of like subtle so I did it over white and you can see that that has really stamped um, really well. Again I'm using this Born Pretty uh, polish it's part of the new collection I think and they really are amazing at polishes I wish I brought more of them um, but as I'd not used them before I didn't know how good they were going to be um, but yeah they really are fantastic value for money and you can see here has stamped amazingly over the black polish so I'm just moving down and selecting different images. This one is a bit like of a Moroccan theme image. So again you can see has stamped really really well. I absolutely love this stamping polish. It is one of my favourites. I love um, the, uh, uh, it's got like a weird, like not weird, I mean, but it's got a really nice shimmer onto it. So I'm just going to put this onto a pop stick here. And wow, I really like that. That is my favourite image so far. With the colours and the image, I think it's really, really um, cool image. So I wanted to get one of this like optical illusion image here. So you can see again that it has stamped really really well, I'm not having any issues with the plates. Sorry I thought I'd recorded <laughs> the sort of stamping process uh, but I didn't. But oh, now this has become my new favourite stamping image. I love that with the different coloured base uh, images, I think it looks uh, really pretty. So this is like another optical illusion um, image as well. I'm going to pop this onto my practice stick. Oh my goodness. Each swatch I keep getting a new favourite. I think that is absolutely gorgeous. I hope my camera is picking up the wonderful hollow underneath. Um, I was really impressed with that image. I wasn't expecting it to look as uh, lovely as that. I don't know if this is going to pick up very well. Okay, so it has stamped well. Uh, again, it's a bit more of a subtle look. Hopefully you can see like the purple shimmer there on the uh, polish. And this is the last image I'm going to be showing you off this plate. I'm not 100% sure what this image is meant to be, but it's a funky is geometric kind of design maybe and again has stamped really really nicely so here's a close-up of all of my uh, swatches that I've done for you guys today I hope you like the images that I have picked out this plate is truly beautiful it is packed full of amazing images and um, you'd be very pleased if you decided to buy it for yourselves so thank you for coming and watching this review today and again thank you for Born, to Born Pretty for sending me the products. Bye!